your Sunday service. I wanted to mention that right away. The resurrection service will be on the 27th this year. We'll be having a 6.30 sunrise service. Hey, someone spelled sunrise right on my calendar. It says S-O-N-R-I-S-E. Yeah, cute, right? Yeah. 6.30 and then 10.30 service. Our special service will be at 10.30 on that day. Guys, please, please come be a part of that. We had a great time the last couple of years for, for, for sunrise services, and it's just remarkable, remarkable time. Uh, this today after church we'll be having our church council meeting. If you're a part of that, please come be. Please, if you're a part of that, please come be a part of that. And that'll be out in the um, youth youth building here, just along the way here. And the next Sunday, uh, we can't wait a second. Why do we keep doing this? Did we cancel? We cancel the next Sunday potluck again. Church potluck. The March sixth. Uh, oh, here you see, it says, um, here's the thing, is, uh, that's right, it's not a church potluck, it's a community potluck. So we cancel a church potluck, and we're going to have a community potluck next Sunday, the 6th. Barbecue, bring salads, chips, sides, and desserts, right? So invite a neighbor or a friend to come be a part of it. Somebody you haven't seen a church for a little while, let's give them a phone call and say, hey, we're having food, come be a part of that after church on Sunday. Uh, shoe boxes this month coming in are hair accessories, jewelry, watches, and sun, small sunglasses. I love announcements. We, uh, Joan and Granny are asking if you wanted to be a part of our um, choir for Easter Sunday. Please make contact with them. We're doing practices on Tuesday night. Is that 6.30 on Tuesday night? There's no time here, right? Correct? Okay. 2.30, two, two, two 6.30 on Tuesday night. And the last, there's a few more things. The last thing I want to bring up, guys is on March 18th will be our first Friday night back after being after taking a sabbatical for a few Friday Friday nights. Listen, I've had the opportunity to review this movie in its entirety. The movie called The War Room. I've had, like I said, its entirety. And I wanted to have a clip shown this morning, but I didn't I had it all together, but I didn't have it together. My fault. Reality is you want to talk about a woman in life, and, and the thing is, is the character in this show brings it so real to life that you believe this is how she lives her life. And I can only believe that people truly live their lives this way. Have a prayer room. Um, I was thinking about throwing my kids out of the house so I could use their room as a prayer room. But they're young still. Right? Hard to get in the booth. But anyways, come be a part of that. It'll be at 6.30 that night, the 18th, where we'll be showing that movie. Invite a friend to come be a part of that also to come see the movie. Okay? Heavenly Father, we come to you for you right now, Lord. We just thank you. Well, we just thank you that, guess what? We just thank you for the fact that King Jesus did something unkinglike and gave his life for us. And we thank you for that. In his own King Jesus' name, amen. Amen.